Hello everyone, welcome to Radiology Case Review Series. In this video, we are going to look at images of an elderly male patient who presented to emergency department with right lower quadrant abdominal pain. Clinical team was concerned about acute appendicitis. His CT examination was ordered for further evaluation. On the CT examination, as I scrolled on, you can see gallstones without evidence of inflammation. As I keep scrolling down further, you can see a normal appendix in the right lower quadrant connecting to the base of the cecum. However, we see an inflamed bowel loop. You can see the hyperenhancing mucosa with submucosal edema in the right lower quadrant arising from the terminal ileum, which is blind ending with mild surrounding fat stranding. We can see similar findings on the coronal reformats. We can see the normal appendix which is arising from the cecum. There is a diverticulum arising from the terminal ileum, which is dilated with hyperenhancing mucosa with submucosal edema, which is blind ending. Also, we can see a non-obstructing stone in the terminal ileum. Imaging appearances are consistent with Meckel's diverticulitis. In terms of Meckel's diverticulitis, classically it's described as seen in up to 2% of the population based on autopsy studies. Most patients are asymptomatic during their lifetime. However, complications can be seen in up to 40% of the patients. As we saw in our patient, the diverticulum can get inflamed. Due to presence of ectopic gastric mucosa, these diverticulum can bleed. Another complication, particularly in pediatric patients, is intersusception. Rarely there can be congenital bands associated with Meckel's diverticulum leading to small bowel obstruction. As we saw in a patient, Meckel's diverticulum can be associated with stones which can be obstructive or non-obstructive. Rarely due to repeated bouts of inflammation, there can be malignant changes in the Meckel's diverticulum. I hope you found this case of Meckel's diverticulum to be interesting and informative. Thanks for your attention.